Welcome, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. This is Goldsmith Gaming with me, Christopher. We're back with Hogwarts Legacy and my first playthrough of the game. Playing as a Ravenclaw student on hard difficulty. Last time, well, we got this place, the Room of Requirement. We finally have it. This sort of a last and missing puzzle piece in the the game in some ways, because the uh, other thing we got a bit before it, and that was broom flying. So I can now fly a broom when I'm outside, which is just lovely. Don't exactly know how much use we're gonna get to that uh, directly, but uh, I suppose we'll find out eventually about that. So uh, while I'm here, this is not done. Okay, fine. This does not work uh, when you're not playing the game. I've noticed that now. But one thing that uh, we are going to have to start thinking about is this. We need to make uh, Edris Potion and Maxima Potions, and we need to actually buy those things. So that's uh, one thing we need, but we need Ashwinder Eggs and Mongrel Fur. I don't think we can grow those. So exactly how I get those, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, now, what are we doing? What are, what are we doing today? What are we doing today? I haven't really been looking a lot at talents still. Kind of need to get into that. Uh, but the big thing is that we're going to go and talk to Sebastian. We're going to learn Confringio from that. And I think that that sounds fine. I kind of possibly do want to do the Pulso as well. Hmm... Which one do I want to do first? You know what? You know what? I'm going to do this one first. Uh, because I did want to go back to Hogsmeade and buy those potion thingamajigs anyway. Not exactly how I'm going to get the Maxi Manager's potions. Well, I mean, we can just buy the ingredients, I suppose. Uh, so yeah, you know what? Let's start with that one. That feels... it feels quick and easy. Does it? So uh, why don't we head over to Hogsmeade, buy those things from uh, the, the place, and uh, see what we can do with them. Alright then, right outside Pippin's here, and you know what? I, I thought that when I saw one of these guys before, that they were sort of just uh, having having a bit of a laugh and a bit of a uh, yoking around with the, with the side. But no, I realized that you were one of those guys. One of those guys that we can see in our world as well, where they flip uh, flip signs, etc, etc. Alright, so we have those in this world as well. What would you know? And also, oh, this is very, very color-coded to me. I like it. Alright then, let's have a bit of a look in we here. We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. I will, and... Oh, wait. Did you, by any Rebellion. chance... Do you by any chance have one of those chests with the, with, with what the um, eyes? Well, I see, I think, one of them down there. Uh, but all right, no, you actually did not have anything in here. So, but I want, I, I need stuff. G give me stuff. All right, we need recipes. 1,000. Wow, all right then. Well, I can actually have forward both of the ones that I need, which are the Focus Potion and the Maxima Potion. Alright, well that was expensive, bloody oh, hell. Wise eh? decision. Thank you. And we're gonna need at least one of you. Also a bit expensive, but I don't exactly know how otherwise to get that. We need... come on. There we go, need you. Now there was something that he actually apparently needed a little bit of help with. I'm gonna... well actually, actually you know what, wait, don't I have already have that mission? Yeah, something about a delivery. Have you already given me this? Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with a delivery? Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often, giving me no time to brew? If you take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. Well, that's pretty good. Uh, Alright then, yeah, I'd be happy to help. I'd be happy to help with the delivery. You've no idea how grateful I am, truly. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. All right then, good. Any chance I can just 
Yeah, you know what? Invisibility Potion 4, but deliver 3. Ooh, I get one for free. Now, here's the problem. Here's the problem. Collection. Uh, if we go into... Where are... You are here. Can I... Can I? Here we go. Adurus Potion is what I bought stuff for. Uh, Invisibility Potion. Uh, now let's see. Maxima. Leech Use and Spider Fang. Have lots of those. I don't need to buy anything for that. Can do a lot of Wig and Wells. Focus Potion. I need Fluxweed Stem. Alright then. You probably sell those as well. So let's have a bit of a look at that. It would appear as if you don't. Alright. No Fluxweed uh, thingamajig here. Well, that's annoying. So, where would I get those then? And do I have information about that? Tools, enemies, appearances, revealio, bees, brooms, ingredients. Um, do I know about said thing? Did any know? I don't even know about them. Well, that's a bit tricky then. How do I, how do I, how do I know where to go then? No, 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 never, never mind. Fluxweed, here we go. Uh, the magic neep. Right. All right, then, so we need to uh, heh, neep over there. Uh, all right, then, that's cool, that's cool. Because uh, I kind of want to have a bit of a look at that place anyway, I suppose. How did I get uh, just around the corner, so to speak? Yes, indeed, down here. And where was it? Is it up? Wait. Now I'm a bit confused. Oh, hello. But there is a thing here. Just for me. Lovely. Uh, was it... Is it... Was it that thing? Yes, it was. There we go. I, I, okay. Whoa, there was water here. Sorry. Sorry, Crisp. You're fine. You're fine. That's absolutely okay. Why do you have a gate there where you can just run on the side of it? Well, actually, this is... Wait. Oh, did I just... Ah, right. There, There's the bridge that I was thinking about. <laughs> Bloody hell. Uh, here we go. This is where we're going. Hello, my good sir. Oh, you. So, yes, indeed. This guy does have Fluxweed Stem. Now, you Now, you have let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Fluxweed Seed. Not grass seed. Mallow with uh, <laughs> What did that say? Shrivel thing, yes. And also fertilizer. Um, as my money is running a bit low at the moment, yes, uh, or rather, let's just wait with these, but uh, know that he does have them. And with that, we are going back to uh, the room of requirement and uh, see if we can't make a few potions. Alright then, back we are. Are you... Ooh, 38 seconds. Uh, Alright then, potion station. We need an Endurus potion. Do that. Alright, that's actually take a bit of time. That's fine, then we'll just wait for it. And there we have it. Pick that up. Yes, and thank you. We also need the Maxima Potion. That's uh, another 30 seconds for that one. And that's done too. And finally, the Focus Potion. Because I don't think... Yeah, th those are the ones that I need. I don't need to do Wigan World Potions right now. So, oh, that's a bloody minute. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, we can do, you know what, while you're brewing, so to speak. Let's go over and pick you up. Now... I don't have... how do I... Can't... Ah, right, I can empty the pot here, but I don't think I have anything else. And also, obviously, I can uh, incre or rather add fertilizer, that's true, but... Uh, I'm just gonna hold on to that, by the way. Uh, now, wh while we're here, actually... Uh, conjuring spell... That is not how you do that. Um, Potions, how do I unlock these? Uh, no, not you. Oh, no, it is you. Tomes and scrolls. T-shaped. Ooh, lovely. Uh, all right, as we buy stuff from tomes and scrolls, if we want potion stations, you are also tomes and scrolls. We need to actually check that out then, I think. Yes, okay, we need to check that out to see... Uh, see you know, what the those entail, etc. Focus potion, interact with that, got that. Now, we are not focused on the correct quest, we are focusing on this one. So, acquire and use potion, and then maximum endurance potions and use them simultaneously. Can't I just use all of them immediately? We'll see. Uh, so, how do I, how do I do this then? 
That is just ingredients. Be ah, I can have beasts, by the way. That's fun. Uh, where do I have... Where do I have... Wait, let's go out. I haven't been using this. Oh, you do this, right? Yes, here we go. Oh, wait, did I actually... Oh, bloody hell, I already... I already had a, a Duris potion. Oh, well. Uh, focus potion. Let's uh, use that one. And we used it with, I think, X? No? Uh, up? No? Wait, how did I use... Ah, right. Just one click. There we go. Ooh, focus. I don't exactly know what that does, uh, but cool. Right, so we hold the, 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 There we go. So do that. Shuck that in, and then the Maxima Potion. Shuck that. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, all right, then. And with that, we are looking fancy. We are looking like a rock, basically. Cool. Uh, so let's head over to potions class and uh, learn ourselves a new spell. When Professor Sharp is so Alright then, we've done the little uh, cutscene there of us having a bit of uh, potion action going. But I need to talk to Professor here, so what's up? I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn Depulso. Let's see what you can do. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. Alright then, new spell time. Seems fairly easily. There we go, nothing to it. You've got it now. If you'd like to practice, and I think you should, perhaps best not to go flinging your classmates about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Absolutely, but you apparently also have... Revelio. A thing. There we go. Uh, lovely. Professor Sharp's order badge. Or is comprised the Ministry's magical law enforcement and protect the wizarding world from all sorts of threats, particularly those posed by dark magic. This order badge belongs to Professor Sharp. Cool. Uh, all right. So we have spell or books, not spells, books. Uh, now, what did I just learn? I learned the pulse oh, repels stuff. So if I just do the pulse, oh. pulse well on you. Done. I'm glad to see that you seem staunchly determined to master your spellcasting. Uh huh. Not entirely sure what that did, but I suppose okay, fine. It just pushes things Still away. Added, I see. Well. Repetition can be an excellent teacher. Good, good, good. But I think that uh, Accio is still going to be what we use uh, on a day-to-day -day basis. Maybe I should... Uh, you know what? Yes. I have... Uh, how many talent, po talent points do I have even? I have five of them. Um, uh, core, I think. Yes. Let's actually get this one. Now I can hold RT. RT. Yeah, that is RT. I, I know about that. Uh, ah, there we go. Oh, no, wait. Ah, that was up. Okay, so up is uh, that one, right is that one. Cool. Uh, so now, I think, for this one, we'll have you there. I haven't got anything yet for those, so I'll do you there. You can go... No, wait. There, right? Go, go, go away. Uh, can I not... Can't I just not have anything on the top? <laughs> Alright, and you know what? Fine. You... No, wait. Actually, no, 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 no. I'm completely wrong. It's supposed to be that way. There we go. Uh, so basically now we can do that and we'll have different variants. Cool. And ideally, I would actually like to... Uh, uh, I think I would actually like to have a third one. We can have just one for only the rumor requirement things, but uh, that's fine for now, I think. All right, then. That's one more spell learned. Let's uh, let's learn another one. Let's do the main mission here. Confringio. More damage uh, stuff or more explosion-y cool things. Yes. So let's have a bit of a meet with Sebastian. He was actually... Yeah, he was actually not 
terribly far away. All right then, Sebastian, you're here waiting for me. And uh, while we were moving here, we actually got uh, some stuff from Owl. Some stuff from Owl. Uh, we got more from uh, Mr. Sharp, I do believe. Right, what was it? It was you, right? Yeah, there we go. Defindo, the severing charm. So he has more uh, stuff for us now, but uh, let's focus on Sebastian now. Even though I not, don't particularly care for this guy, let's have a bit of a chat. Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. There's a secret passage just here. It's well disguised. Well, that sounds interesting. Ooh. It's not... It's not very hidden away, is it? All right, then into the Undercroft we go. How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. He named it the Undercroft. We used to play Govstones here all the time. With my sister, Anne. She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep this between us. He never confides in anyone. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. We used to sneak in here almost daily. We've never been caught. Well, that's lovely. How the hell did you get in there? Because I le went in there without you. Did you just teleport in here? Maybe you did, after all, but uh, that was a bit weird. Why did they do it that way? No idea. All right, then, Sebastian, you want to learn, uh, or rather teach me, come Fringio, don't you? I think I've seen Ominous in potions. Or was it Herbology? I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. I've never heard anyone else speak of it, and I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets, but this place is special to him. Understood. But why does Ominous have no love lost for his family? His father's family are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Obsessed with blood status, most of them. Ominous cannot abide them, as he'll be the first to tell you. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to, away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the Blasting Curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. All right, interesting. And by the way, Gaunt, isn't, uh, isn't that uh, one of the uh, Death Eaters in the movies? I think that possibly rings a bell. All right then, that's ridiculous. Students should be able to know all the spells. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. But you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. It may take a while to get the feel for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Very well. Ah, I said Confringio. That was a little bit too much. Only Confringo. All right, then. Uh, nothing to it. A Z. We're doing the Zorro spell here. Cool. Go with it. A little bit of a weird movement there, but in the end, we got it. You're getting it. Ready to actually try it out? Stick to the targets, though. Best to keep the Undercroft intact. 
Have a go at those candelabras. Both have their uses, but I think you'll find that a Confringo cast travels a bit farther than that of a spell like Incendia. That sounds reasonable. Yes, so what we'll do is we'll actually replace Incendio here. Confringo! Come on! Nice work. How does it feel? It's a tad hot. You'll get used to it. Uh huh. You want me to do more? That's it. I think I've got it. Well done. That was already lit, though. All right, then, Sebastian. Did I do well? I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our eyebrows. <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, there's something about that spell that's addictive. Ooh, is it because it's a curse, maybe? All right, then, I am ready for more like this. What have you got for me? This is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. There's more where that came from. I've been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, I didn't tell Anne and Ominous about every one. I haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do... Perhaps when I next head to Feldcroft, you could come along. Meet Anne. She could use some cheering up. Absolutely. By the way, you just said that you've been here for ages. You're a fifth year student, you've been here five years. <laughs> That's not an age, but okay. Maybe for a 15 year old it is an age, but all right, fine. Uh, I'd be glad to, I suppose. Just let me know when and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. Well, meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. Might it have something to do with Victor Rookwood? He didn't mistake you for someone else at all in Hogsmeade, did he? Nothing gets past you. I'll tell you what I can. Rookwood and Ranrock are trying to recover something they think I took from a vault in Gringotts. Gringotts? When were you there? Professor Fig and I wound up there after the dragon attack. There was this port key that... A port key? To Gringotts? Well, it's all a bit convoluted. I'm listening. Why am I telling you all of this? No, 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 we're not gonna tell you. Bloody hell, Crisp, we're not supposed to tell anyone. Jesus, you blabbermouth. The book I found in the restricted section was missing some pages. That's about it. Pity. Didn't think you'd disappoint me with so vague an answer. I suppose with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you, a bit more time practicing the blasting curse is in order. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you an owl. Sounds good, mate. Uh, all right, then. And let's indeed leave the Undercroft. See, uh, see what the next step is here. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. You there! I can hear you! Oh, hello. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together. And herbology? I recognize that voice. Heard you talking to Gareth Weasley in potions class. You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? I mean, I just waved my wand and got in. It wasn't that difficult, you know. Um, you know what, I'll be frank with you. Sebastian did show me. Actually, Sebastian brought me there, but he made it perfectly clear to keep quiet about it. That rat! You breathe a word about this place to anyone, and not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the Headmaster, and I'm not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. Ooh, you're a bit, uh, you're a bit Draco Malfoy. I like it. We haven't seen any uh, Malfoys, which is downright weird. But uh, yeah, you kind of fit the bill right now. All right, then, no need for threats, you bastard. You needn't threaten me. I'm not going to say anything about your Undercroft. Why should I trust you? You just betrayed Sebastian. Please. I was trying to defend him. He was clear that this was a secret place, and I was to tell no one. He's a good friend. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Ominous, I just meant- I know what you meant. 
Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Sebastian is going to get an earful about this. I mean, I literally got told by Sebastian all of that, so, you know what, screw you, man. Damn Slytherins, you can never trust them, can you? And he actually goes inside, that's lovely. All right, then, do we have do we have a next step in main story, or are we waiting? We are mating. M mating? We're not mating, we're waiting. Uh, so improve magical abilities to get to the next trial, as it's called. Well, all right, you want uh, a visibility potion. I, I, I actually have an extra one of those. And then... Uh, a Thunderbrew potion. Bloody hell, I don't have the money right now. So, you know what? As I don't have the money for it, uh, da, 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 da. we'll do this one because uh, apparently that's going to give me a bit of cash and I should be. Uh, have Ooh, hello, read mail. Come and see me as soon as you can. I've returned from a rather unproductive trip to the ministry, hoping your time has been more fruitful than mine. All right, and what Professor Fig actually does want to talk like to us. Oh, hello. Wingardium Leviosa. It can be used to levitate objects for a short time. Once you've completed a few prerequisite tasks, do see me after class. Well, that would be lovely. Yes, I would love to learn more spells. Yes. I'd better um, keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Bloody hell, you don't have to... I, I'm about to, you know, just finish that mission so he doesn't say this every bloody time. Uh, now, how was it that I... It was... No, wait, here. Wait, no, yes. There we go. That's how we got up. Uh, so, now, when you say high places, by the way, do we ever... Do I need to do this? Do I need to sort of look for stuff over here? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but all right. You know what? Do I have do I have a closer a closer where am I going exactly? Oh, I'm going way down here. Well, we have a flu station which oh, come on, which is at least a little bit closer. So why don't we uh, head out from here instead? And obviously, no, I'm not going to be flying, because, uh... Oh, hello, what did we get here? Oh, no. Throwing rocks, is that... Bloody hell. Um, no, I'm not going to... Yeah, 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 yeah. I haven't, I haven't gotten to your thing yet. We have a guy over here, but that's fine. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. That is true. Uh, what I was about to say Rebellion. was that I uh, don't want to fly because there might be stuff along the way that I might want to either find or, you know, loot, etc. So I'm just going to run around a little bit. Oh, hello. It's just random guys out here. Just, just people, just students walking about. Well, I can't say too much. I mean, I am a student just walking about, so fine. Let's give myself a few more of those lovely moonstones. I have so many of them. It's not like I really need more. Revelio. Hello. Sheep and spiders. All right. Well, I don't need to kill more spiders at this very point in time. That was just some cash lying around, which is lovely. And there is a mission here, apparently. What does that say? Beasts welcome. All right. Cool. So what's up here then? There is a quest here. Hello. Well, there was a... Oh, no, no, no. It wasn't a, a quest. It was a page. Hebridian Black is a larger dragon that can grow to over 9 meters in length. A large, large rough scale originally belonging to one of the beasts is one of the prized possession that Archie Pickle keeps in his hideout. So this is Archie Bickle's hideout, apparently. <laughs> All right, then. Rebellion. What do we have here? More spiders? Can I avoid you? But still pick up stuff. No, you kind of <laughs> want to... Oh, hello. Oh, no, 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 no. We're fine. We're fine. Oh, hello. What is this over here? Is that a Merlin trial? Yes. Okay, Let's so, see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Uh -huh. You know what? I do want to do this, if I can. Now, what is this one, then? I see something up there. Do I just... Uh... Expelliarmus! Well, probably not Expelliarmus, you doofus. Here we go. Confringo. 
Fringo, and Fringo, and Fringo, and Fringo, and I've probably missed one. Oh yeah, there we go. I probably missed more, but I think I have the right spell at least. So there, there we go. That's another one. Very hidden. I mean, I'm not entirely sure if I'm doing the right thing here. Yeah. Finding more and more of them. Another one. Oh, Dark Mongrel. Settled. Lovely. We have one more of those. Wasn't really what I was supposed to do here, but you know what? I do want to have a little bit of exploration in these videos. That's true. Hello. Rebellion. There's a cow here. Just uh, grazing peacefully. Oh, hello. What are you? What bush are you? You are Lacewing. All right. Good. Good to know. I, I sort of vaguely thought that there would be more stuff to pick up because, I mean, there's a lot of stuff that we can do. But I'm not picking up a lot of it, <laughs> so to speak. Uh, all right. We have some of the mushrooms. That is good. So, leaping toadstool. Do I know what I use those on? Revelio. Not a hundred percent sure that I do. Hello. Yes. Uh, interrupt a dark mongrel with depulso. Is apparently a thing. That's a new dueling thing of a jig. Well, I don't so much care about that right now. Uh, I'm actually here. Revelio. Not attack. Ooh, hello, crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! You are actually all right. But I don't have the pulso out now. Oh crap, oh crap. Confringo. There we go. That did good work. Levioso. There we go. No, 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 no. No, no, oh, uh, hello. No, why are you have a really long? Levioso. You have a really long tool, don't you? Well mongrels seem to be fine. You know what? You just don't seem to be attacking me. Well, actually, didn't I... Wait. Have I done this the wrong way around? I think I did. No, 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 it's fine. Okay, you know what? Oh, no, that's Akio. That's Akio. Bloody hell. Depulsa. Oh. I don't know what I did, but I got some longer fur for it. Bloody hell. Uh, that is... Wait, have I... Wait. This is not the... No, it is the right way. Wait, 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 wait. Accio's supposed to be... Oh, bloody hell. I've set this up wrong, I feel like. Uh, no, no, no. I, I was basically correct. Uh, let's do that. We're supposed to have the pulse up here. There we go. Uh, all right, then. Some mongrels dead. And I've done a charging mongrel. I, I thought I did, but... Uh... I also was a little bit confused if I did. Rebellion. But that's good. I have another challenge or dueling thingamajig. Now that's just a uh, tiny, tiny mongrel. I can kill you Depulsa. quite easily. Oh, no. There we go. Akio. There we go. Haha. -ha. Screw you. There we go. Lovely. Killing mongrels. Rebellion. Good, good fun. I mean, it isn't so fun to explore in the night time, that is true, but it's fine. Oh, hello, we also have a deer, or something. Oh, hello, 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 hello. Are we cool? You know what, you're on your own. You're on your own. Yes. No, actually, you weren't on your own. That's fine. You weren't so much on your own, but basically on because I killed you Ugh. immediately. Shame you're so foul. Oh, that's not fair to the spider. Uh, all right, and we have a bit of a house here. Interesting. And apparently some mongrel fur just lying about. Well, I'll have that. Ooh, there is... I was about to say, is something burning over there? <laughs> or on the fire? No, not really. There's also a cart rolling around here. Okay, lovely. Uh, yeah, what is this... <sighs> building them. Can I get in? No, we cannot because there's a lock on it. Damn it. I need to learn Alohomora. 
Who can teach me a lot of Umura anyway? Rebellion. Uh, what do we have here? We have more spiders. Okay, well, can we just... Uh, no. Levioso. Go. Bam, 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 bam. And now my Leviosos do... Uh, my Leviosos actually hit multiple targets. Levioso. That's beautiful. Bam. No, okay. Apparently not. Oh, crap. That's fine. Go. You're dead. Tiniest amount of XP, but it's fine. Spider fangs, yes. Uh, Alright, then. Where are we going? Where are we going? Okay, do we get any thousands some water? Rebellion. Do we have water stuff? Do we have those weird critters I'm supposed to kill here? Not that I can see. We had them in the forest, but not here, apparently. Alright, then. Rebellio, Rebellio, Rebellio. <laughs> Here we go, bunch of bushes. Now this is looking better. Over there are some broom training practice trial thingamajigs. You can see those in the distance. Alright then, we made it to this place. And can you just keep running when I tell you to run? Damn it. Uh, that is... The should have been here by now. Hello, Fatima. Uh, that is oh, another Merlin trial. a pleasant surprise. Interesting one. Okay, we're not going to do... What the hell is over there? Uh, that's fine. We have the flu station. And Fatima, that's probably that you. Yes, indeed. Hello, Fatima. Madam Luang, I have a delivery from J. Pippin's potions. <laughs> Sent a child to do his work for him, did he? Always cutting corners and taking the easy way out. Did he have you brew them for him as well? Doesn't matter. You could probably do it better than he can anyway. You're a little bit, uh, bit on the nasty side. Why are you like that? And uh, yeah, why are you buying from him if he's so bad at it? Why do you keep ordering from him if you think the quality to be inferior? It would seem I have more and more customers who are trying to stay out of sight. I'm not one to judge. You can simply imagine the stress I'm under to deliver quality products. Unlike some vendors, I strive to keep my customers satisfied. And you do that by ordering inferior potions. Something is not adding up here, Fatima. Here are the potions you requested. You think it's so simple? I know Pippin is always trying to cheat his customers. Cutting corners to save some galleons for himself at the expense of quality. You'll not be getting a canut out of me until you prove the potion works. Drink it. Ah, that is why I got a spare one, I see. All right, then. Fair enough. I'll be invisible for you. Seems simple enough. I'll do it. I should think so. So, yes, indeed. Uh, into the menu. And that is down there. Drink potion. Turn invisible. Are you cool with this now? It seems to have worked. Hmm. Well, I suppose that will do. If the demand for potions is as high as you say, have you considered being easier to work with? Perhaps combining your recipes and skills? Ha! <laughs> Not a chance. That ne'er-do-well had his shop handed to him. The rest of us had to make our own way. I'll not give him the benefit of my hard work and gumption. If he fails on his own, so be it. Well, all right then. So what kind of customers do you have anyway? You mentioned that more and more customers are trying to stay out of sight. Why? Well, I can't speak for all of them, but certainly my Ashwinder customers have their reasons. If I were you, I'd forget I heard that. Aha, uh -huh, that didn't really make a whole lot of sense to me, but sure. <sighs> Very well. I shall let Mr. Pippin know I delivered the potions as requested. You do that. And what about your money? Uh, but alright, what do you have to sell, by the way? What do you have for sale? Well, you, you, you have basically nothing. You're a terrible, terrible shop and you should feel bad about yourself. Yeah, I don't know what uh, he is or Pippin is gonna be uh, worried about because this is no competition whatsoever. Uh, all right, then. Anything else in this place? We have a page over here. So what? Uh, what is Rebellion. this related to? This is the tilted house. Local calls this uh, the tilted house due to the old angle at which it is wrapped in the roots of the overhanging tree. So that is uh, Highlands guides, and we have. 
a chest. It's ripe for the taking. Bit of money there. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, hello. I'm just gonna go in and eat all your stuff. This is a weird house, by the way. Yes, I can see. I can see why this is a weird house. Uh, all right, then. Well, is this just to the outside, then? Yes, it is. It is also a very tiny house and doesn't have, like, an outhouse, as far as I can tell. Uh, all right, then. Well, maybe this is the outhouse. Not really. Uh, all right, then. All right, then. All right, then. And let's also check uh, more stuff here. Oh, hello. Do we have a notice board a la Witcher 3 style? We both do and don't. That is, however, a locked door again. Bloody hell. Where can I... Oh, yes. Drink the random bear that's uh, hanging out. That's a good boy. Uh, all right, then. Well, we have another chest at the back here. Green gingham gloves. We'll Revelio. have a bit of a look at that at some point. There was a chest here also, by the way. So what is that? The ginger root. The barkeep in Cambridge keeps a stock of ginger root. Handed to fend off his customer's nausea. And keep them imbibing a bit longer. Ooh, that's, that's a good way to do it, yes. Uh, now that chest that I can see is that inside. It seems to be inside. There's also something down there. Is that also... That doesn't look like to be on the inside. Come on. Come on, you, 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 uh, why are you swimming that weird, weird Rebellion. No, 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 you are actually in here, hello. <gasps> There's a bag with a grey nightcap, which is terrible, I do not want it. Uh, alright then, is there, there is something over here, you have another house, and can, can you run, please? Ooh, can I steal your things? Uh. I hope I can, because uh. you shouldn't have your, ooh, hello, uh, ooh, that's interesting. So that uh, Merlin's uh, thingamajig, there is a ball here. Oh, there's also... I was about to say, there's just a tiny, tiny, tiny little cloud here. Just watering the plants. That's quite nice. But alright, I'm gonna assume that this thing... goes somewhere. Does it go... Well, I'm gonna check this out. I said I wasn't gonna do maybe all of these um, uh, on cam. Could it be? A Merlin trial. Do we even have... I seem to have more stuff, so that's good. So yeah, what do you... want from me? Because that didn't change much. It definitely has to do with the ball. I'm gonna... I'm gonna come out and say that. I'm definitely gonna come out and say that it has something to do with the ball. And I can see that you are very nicely aligned with that thing. Um, so it has to be the Pulso then. Oh crap. Uh, it has to be the Pulso. So if I do this... The Pulso! Kabam! Keep doing it! There we go. There we go. Lovely. Now, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to do this, to be honest. Like, are you supposed to go to the thing? Kabam! I don't know if this is right, but uh, I'm gonna at least try it. Okay, we got you over there, and then we go to here. So, like, if I get... But this doesn't sound Back right. Here. And that is uh, way too heavy for me, but okay. Well, alright, I moved it a bit, but uh, am I supposed to move it, like, all the way over here or something? Okay... Aha! Yes, I am! There's a bloody hole for it. We're basically playing pool here. And uh, obviously... Oh, no, 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 no. I wanted to do... No, no, no. No, no. Damn it. There we go. <laughs> bloody hell. Controls! They're difficult sometimes. Um, the Pulsar! The Pulsar, you... Hey! It disappeared on me! Okay, so what I then assume is the thing is that we need to find... Can you... Why is he not running? <laughs> Such a weird thing. Uh, so I'm gonna assume then that we're gonna need to find another ball, possibly. And that is a graveyard. How lovely. Uh, Alright, so presumably, yes indeed, there's a ball somewhere else here, maybe? Oh, hello, what was that? That is, a, that is a dog bog. Hello, we have a dog bog here. Uh, but yeah, okay, so this is uh, gonna be... I mean, I think I have the right idea, but why did it just disappear? It definitely feels like it's... that like this is the only ball, right? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna give it another 
try. You know what, also, can I just Levioso you by any chance? Or... Bloody hell, Crisp! Get over there. Good job. Levioso. Can I? No, not Levioso either. Depulso. But like, if I keep doing this, does can I only do it a couple of times? Is that a thing, possibly? Yeah, there we go. We'll go the right way. Because I'm thinking that it went away because it's too far from the thing. I don't know. Okay, so it just disappeared <laughs> on me for the first time around. And it could be that it has, like, a maximum number of times I can do this. But it could also just have been that it bugged out. <laughs> that is entirely possible. Because I am absolutely crushing this one. Go in the hole! Oh, come on. There we go. Lovely! Now the question is, was that enough for a thingamajig? Uh, that would be expiration, I think. No, it was not. Oh, six of them. Bloody hell. All right, then. Fine. Well, we are not doing that. You know what? Before we end the episode, let's have a bit of a look here. We've done uh, this one. Yes. Haven't done that. Did I? Had I done anything? I've already accepted those. Here we go. I can have officer's uniform. Cool. Uh, mongrels. Still don't know about some of the other ones. Field guide pages. I've done this one. Very, very ugly Highland Explorer cap. I do not want that. Not so much, no. Uh, so there we go. Those were the ones that I got on. For some reason, I still haven't unlocked the room of requirement challenges. So what is it that I'm supposed to do in there then? Interesting. Well, alright then, I think that that is about it for this episode. And in the next one, well, okay, you know what, fine. We'll finish the episode by actually returning to Perry Pippin and deliver the stuff. Hopefully he is open even though it's night time. His little uh, sign worker is however gone. Are you open? You seem to be open, Hello that's there. lovely. In the I have delivered the potions to Fatima. I delivered the potions to Fatima Luang. Very good. And uh, did she cause you any trouble? Not so much. Also, yeah, F Fatima. I'm saying it in the Swedish way, I just realized. Uh, she's a bit of a difficult character, yes. Well, I can see why you didn't want to go. She was quite cantankerous. I do truly appreciate your help. And at least it's done with. Uh-huh. So, you know what? Because she was such a bastard, I want more money. Delivering those potions was a bit more work than I'd expected. I'd like an additional fee. I suppose that's business for you. Very well, I shall increase your pay, but I'm not at all pleased about it. By the way, I found this book of potion recipes in Kingbridge. Might it be useful to you? Is this Fatima's recipe book? Oh, when did I find that exactly? Well, if it is, she doesn't deserve it back. I totally agree there. You should keep it. She doesn't deserve to have it. I appreciate what you're saying, but you have much to learn about respecting the property of others. Some things are sacred amongst potioners. I shall return it to her immediately. Oh well, he was a bit boring about that, wasn't he? Um, Alright then, I did actually, with that, do another challenge, wouldn't you know, in quests. I've done side quests! I have done now what I need to do to get the legendary armored attire again. Probably don't really want that. No, and also this one. Uh, what is that? Lucky Leprechaun gloves. Lovely. And also we are moving now into the Lucky Leprechaun hat. We had the bookish Hellframe spectacles from before. All right, I'm fair enough. Also, oh, I done this apparently ages ago. Top of the class scarf. Isn't that cool? And uh, indeed, we're going for the ensemble after this. So where are we going in the next episode? I think I kind of want to go for, yeah, the map chamber. That seems like what I want to do. We have a bunch of uh, stuff. Venomous Tentacula and Manrake. We need to use that. 
or the Guardian of the Osa. If it's the Bitter Potion, I have now used. Good. And then we need to do the Thunder Brute Potion. I have some money now, I think. Uh, where do I see? Yeah, there we go. 1,100, so I can actually get some more stuff. That's good. Now, this one is probably better than what I have. Not a whole lot, but I still haven't started with uh, traits, though, so... Uh, you know what, I'll keep the ones I have, that's fine. Uh, Alright then, I think that that is indeed good for this episode. So next episode we are going back to the map room, presumably with Fig, or, well, maybe by ourselves, I do not know, but in some ways we are going there. And uh, the, 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 the guy, per Percival, I am... I cannot remember his name. It's also with R, isn't it? It's not Rockwood or Ranrock, but it's something with R, isn't it? By the way, hello. Ah, right, you're just one of those that cuts the thing. Right then, yes, we are doing that and uh, pushing the main story a little bit further along, I should say. For now, though, this has been Ghostman Gaming with me, Christopher. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.